Grace and Stevie. Empower, invest, grow. The Cocoa Park Technical College Foundation was founded in 1992 and established in 1993. The, the event took place on February 21st, 2012 on Tuesday at noon to 1.30 at the Rainier Room, Building 31. Gerardo and Norman was actually there, so I felt relieved because I didn't, my partner here had an emergency, so I felt, I felt relieved that they were there actually, so I felt comfortable. The first thing that we did were just greeting each other, and uh, Steve Crosby, which is the person to call the order, told the students to gather around food and like break the food cycle. I don't know what he meant by that, but he told us to get our food and then we sat and he told us to in introduce ourselves. He asked us for our name, our career field, why we chose that, and why we chose to go to Clover Park Technical College. After we had done that, we talked about the agenda. In the agenda, we, there was a report in the president's report, there's actually a welcome student visitors from public speaking class. So I thought that was really, I thought that was really good. I felt welcome. I didn't expect that because usually they won't put that in the agenda. And next is um, uh, our environmental science, Leslie Hoag. I'm going to read to you what she said about the scholarship. And it's listed for Empower. She talked about working toward my degree has been an uphill battle. I am a single mother and am now working three part-time jobs. It has been a struggle to not lose heart and abandon my dream. Your scholarship has helped to make it possible for me to continue to pursue my educa educational goals. I am truly thankful for your generosity. I thought that was really good. And actually, the scholarship statistic shows in 2012, the winter quarter, the scholarship, there was 29 scholarships and 77 applications and the amount awarded were 15,000 by winter quarter. In the spring quarter, there were 37 scholarships, 100 applications and 20,350 amount awarded. In the agenda, there's also a survey for student success. And one of, one of the questionnaire were preferred classroom pace. There were 74% of Clover Park Technical College students preferred regular deadlines, and 26% preferred self pace, where, I can, where they can set their own deadlines and move ahead at their own speed. <laughs> purpose, and another one was purpose for attending. 88% of Clover Park Technical College students were award seeking, 79% degree certificates, 9% is a high school diploma or GED, and I'm one of them, I'm running start. And there is actually a completion barriers. Close to 60% of Clover Park Technical College students struggle with basic needs and college costs. And also, Achieving the dream is a, a it stands for ADT. Um, the ex executive director, which is Debbie Raniger, the teams usually meet twice a month um, to help campus cultural change towards focusing on student success and helping students eliminate to work through barriers and complete their programs. Achieving certificates and degrees. And our employee named Brandon Rogers reported that college had received about 2.8 million in grants funding this year. And that the Woodward Family Foundation had recently granted the foundation of 10,000 for scholarships for students in health science programs. As we know, staff at Cobalt Park Technical College work really hard because they really do care for our <coughs> success. 
and they all work hard as a team to help build the community better and to achieve a better program. As you can see, empower, invest, grow are a way to keep Cobo Park Technical College successfully trained with the best professionals in the industry. And here is my partner, Stevie. She's going to talk about the Tacoma Port. Thank you, Grace. I have um, a lot more props than she does. I need a brief intermission to gather my 